Let's say something.
Syracuse, and I want to put it out to Muskrat and everyone that came from Rochester, and I want to put it from Tom, who drove from Fredonia, and I know some people came from Canada, so this is for everyone that traveled a little bit, it's on our demo, it's called the Day of Atonement, what it's about is coming out to shows like this, and you see a bunch of people that you used to be best friends with and now you get nothing but fucking dirty looks and cold stares and you gotta realize, fuck them they can have their little fucking clicks Support the bands, buy their shit. We have records, please buy one of those if you like what you hear. This song's called Turncoat, it's on our record. It goes out to Kurt Whitney, who did my record and over the last few months has become one of my best friends in the world. This song's for him. Do you feel the music? 
please show us. If you know the words, I'd love it if you sang along. Buffalo bands. They deserve a lot of credit. It's hard work doing this shit. This song's for all them and Lockjaw for sure. This is our intro. It goes into all deceived. What the song's about is fucking money and MTV and bands fucking charging five, six, seven fucking hundred dollars to play something like this. And then you'll see them on fucking MTV and they'll forget about everything. This is for those fucking bands, and most importantly, it's for Choco, because they are nothing, they'll have nothing to do with that, and I respect them so much. Dance it up. I'm gonna enjoy it.
supporting us. Well, we're gonna play is something new. This isn't recorded. It'll hopefully be on whatever we put out next. But it deals with it's fashion shows and hardcore. I don't think the way you dress or the way you fucking comb your hair or the t-shirt you wear fucking matters. I think it's what's up here and most importantly what the fuck's in here. That's what this is about. And I hope everyone drops their bad luck. to express themselves, who keep their whole life pented up, they're their own hostage. They have things on their mind, but they won't let them out because they're afraid what others will say. It's called Stone Face. Thank you very much. Thank you. 
of us went to a show in Mississauga. Our glass played with the Buffalo Band. Uh, I guess some of the people in Canada defy or are like against dancing. I have punched in the face! And I want to say this has nothing to do with fighting or uh, being a hard ass. I got beat up! It's a way for the band and the people to feel the music and bond. And I'm all for dancing. And I'm 100% against violence and stupid punching and things like that. But what, what, hold on a second. What these people did, a few of us were dancing, and I mean like five of us. And what they did was sit down in front of the band so no one could dance. And punch people! And this one girl that was sitting down that I've known for a while got bumped into about that hard. And she turned around and she punched this kid right, right in the face. Back. And that, that's her answer to the problem of dancing. You can't bump into her, but she'll punch you. So what I want to say is... Dancing is a beautiful thing if you know what you're doing. Don't abuse it and please don't take it away. records and uh, me and my girlfriend Dana and Kurt made this magazine and that's a dollar so if anyone's interested see me or someone in the band all right we're gonna play without the light everyone please just stay off the stage it's cramped enough as is um I'm gonna put this song out to Nick Barron who does a lot for the scene if you don't know him he has a lot of stuff for sale back there Please don't die yet. This song's called Decay. It's on our record. If you know the words, please sing along. I'm starting to pass out.
Joel Golden Bloodletter next to her amazing. We're going to do one real quick one. It's called Follow the Leader. Please sing along if you know the words. I don't have time to go into what they're about. Please read them again and again and make your decisions about the Hare Krishna movement and Hare Krishna. It's called Follow the Leader. We're playing next week with Integrity in Lockport. I'm sure a lot of you will be there. If you're not playing, go on, please reconsider. Everyone here that's my friend or the band's friend, the song's for you. You know who you are, especially Chris Lo from me to Chris Logan. Let's end the set on a positive note.